So this is little Glade. He's having a stretch and a cuddle. A little bit of time after his feed. He's even having a little bit of a groom when he feels like it. Hmm? Tickle. Hmm? Shows you being sweetheart. Good boy. As you can see, he is a boy. He's usually a bit of an octopus. He usually grabs at everything, but he's a bit sleepy at the moment, aren't you? Time to go to bed? Sometimes it's hard when you're a little one knowing to, what to do with all your wings, isn't it? With all your limbs? Glade came into care two days ago. He was found on the ground on his dead mum. He's got a bit of a swollen wrist, this one here, but it's gone down a heap, hasn't it? It's looking much better. Did you drop your dummy? Did you drop it? Hmm? Did you drop your dummy? Do you want it back? Stop wriggling. Here we are. Here we are. If they have a dummy in their mouth, they feel a lot more secure because they know that they can't fall because they're holding on. Even if they're not holding on. You don't want it? Here. I think it's bedtime. I think it's bed. I think it's bedtime for you. Here we are. Here we are. Come on. Come on. He's grooming. No, he doesn't have mites, but they groom. They use their feet to comb their fur. They put their face into their wing. I think that's what he's doing at the moment. There we are. He's, he's trying to um, groom his wing. And he's licking it, licking the inside of it. Oh, well done. Okay. Hey, sweetheart. Did you lose your mum, did you? Did you lose your mum? Hello. Hmm? Well, you're using that wing well, aren't you? We call that head bobs and press ups, where they bob their head from side to side and they press up off a chest. They bob their head so that they can triangulate what they're seeing, because their eyes are slightly on the side of their head to give them more um, a wider angle of vision because they're prey animals and they need to be able to see behind them a bit better.
grooming. Stretchies. <laughs> 